And I don't know what's going on in that hotel room. There's no <laughs> lights on. It was just dark. Blair Witch Project. Yeah. <laughs> Did that look to it? It did. He, he, like, yeah. Light up on his head. <sighs> I'm scared. <laughs> yeah, Paul. That may have been my worst movie experience compared to what I was expecting going in. You know what? Remember that when the movie Blair Witch Project, for those who don't know, is like this indie scary movie 15 years ago? Well, it was treated as if it was a documentary. Yeah. Yes. But it, but it, it was just well done. Oh, it was. It was well done. Oh, you didn't like Blair that, Witch at all? That was one of the least scary, scary movies I've ever seen. Oh, okay. Borderline annoying. Okay. Anybody uh, else have that I, reaction? I thought it was awesome. Yeah, I did too. Oh, I thought it was great. Yeah. Do you think I got too built up? Like Definitely. Maybe, yeah. Oh, you can. I mean, that, that happens all the time when somebody goes, you got to see it. And it then was, you go, okay, I'll see it. It was just so creative, too, just the way that they did it. You know, the whole idea of finding these tapes and it's just unedited, you know? Um, I liked super it. Super creative. I liked it. Yeah. Thought it was... You, you, Todd didn't see it. I know that. I did not see the yeah, Blair Witch Project. Of course you didn't. It was Blair Witch Project 4, no, not Cinemax. No, if it was Selma Blair <laughs> Witch Project. That's yeah. a different story. Being like, okay, all right, I'll watch that. And huh? it's like W-H-I-C-H, which... <laughs> Like, there you go. Oh, hey now. Be like discovering Blair Witch. Yeah. Like, okay. What does that mean? Yeah. <laughs> Selma Blair. Uh, and then was Blair Witch Project a good movie? Right now, sixty-five percent of the audience say no. What the heck? The audience is agreeing with Pauly. That never happens. It never happens. About time. I thought Blair Witch was interesting. It I was think different. it's too. It was overhyped by the time people saw it. It could be. Probably. Yeah. What's What's another movie where you went? Okay, I'm going to go see it. Uh, it. Did not live up to what I thought it was going to. Oh man! Anything come to mind? Yeah, Paul. I hesitate to bring this up because it's considered a really good movie. Maverick. No. Top Gun. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Million Dollar Baby, Hillary Swank, uh, and Morgan Freeman, uh, uh, and, and Clint Eastwood. I actually think it is a good movie, a good movie. But I, I remember the months leading up to it. I saw it late. I saw it like two months in. People are like, "This is. Uh, it'll change your life." You. The story is. And I walked in, I was like, yeah, good movie. People are like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I hated that movie. <laughs> first, I'm in the middle. First of all, he leaves the, the, the little seat out there, the stool, and then there's an accident with that. You can spoil it. Yeah. <laughs> she gets hurt. Oh. Yeah, she gets hurt. But, like, who leaves the stool out there in the ring? And nobody noticed. Like, the ref wasn't like, hey. They put the stool out there. They got it in there too early, yep. and then she got hurt. Total cheap shot, though, by that other boxer. Yeah, it was. It was. But Hillary Swank, you know, was was convincing there. Did Morgan Freeman win an Academy Award for that? He might have got nominated. I think Hillary Swank won. She won for yeah. that? Yeah, she. I think she got two. Because she famously forgot to thank her husband. Ooh. Who became her ex-husband. Ex-husband <laughs> soon after that. Foreshadowing. Yeah, there's a reason why I didn't thank him. Why? Oh, he's going to be my ex-husband. Just didn't oh, dawn on me. okay. Yeah. Didn't dawn on me to, uh, to thank him. <laughs> NBC Sports Championship season is going to bring you the Preakness Stakes Saturday at 4.30 Eastern on NBC and Peacock. Uh, how many awards? The Million Dollar Baby win. I got Hillary Swank. I got Morgan Freeman, Best Supporting. I, Hillary Swank won Golden Globe. Uh, Best Picture. Yeah. Uh, nominee, I think Clint Eastwood got, did he get? Director? Yeah, I think he got Best Director. Mm. Yeah, see. You know, I've never seen Avatar or the other, like the new one either. I have not either. Uh, those are supposed to be really good movies, but I'm guessing they're overhyped too, right? And those both made a billion dollars. I think, has he made three of those? I think, does he have like three of the top five movies? James Cameron? Mm, could be. I don't know about He's got since Titanic and two Avatars. Right, and then but then th sprinkled in there are all of the Marvel movies, I think. Oh, okay. Um, but he's right up there for sure. And Maverick, Top oh. Gun is in there too. Hello, Billion mean, dollars, save the industry. It should get every box office total f from when it was released until forever because it saved the industry. It did. It's still saving the industry. Currently. Yes, Todd. I'm looking at something that says there's going to be an Avatar 3 in 2024, Avatar 4 2026, Avatar 5 2028. Okay. How about that? Yeah, Paul. There was a series of movies a long time ago, I mean, at least a decade ago, the uh, Twilight movies. Mm. Now, yeah. First, I'm not a 14-year-old girl, so that's probably the reason I didn't like it. 
Those are among the worst movies I've ever seen. Oh. <laughs> uh, it was Twilight, right? Yeah. Where they turn into wolves. They're, and they, they're vampires, aren't they, they? They're vapid. They they stand around not talking to each other, and then there's a bunch of chase scenes when no one actually gets but killed. But they look hot yeah. while they're standing around. Super modern apartments and stuff. And hot like, people yeah, turn yeah. into vampires, yeah. and, and werewolves yeah. just take them. James Patterson? Yeah. Robert Patterson. Oh, Robert Patterson. Oh, my wife read the books. Like, Marvin, we really should go see Twilight. Is that how she sounds? That's no, but it's voice. Voice. no. <laughs> hey, Mar- hey, Mar- yeah. hey, Marvin. No. Hey, Marvin. She sounds like a Robin Williams' brother and Mrs. Doubtfire. You know, you can stay here as long as you like. <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I never saw Twilight either. You ever saw all those? Team Edward? No. Oh, my God. No. Team Edward. Team Edward. Those are so bad. So and then bad. Uh, uh, Taylor Lautner is in there, right? We had him on the show. He's a nice kid. Yeah, yeah. Beach Bowl. Nice abs. <laughs> sort of cut from the Twilight cloth, but I actually really like these movies, even though I'm not 14 years old. Uh, the Hunger Games, those are good movies. I saw the first one. It's really good. I thought Jennifer Lawrence jumped off the screen. Yeah. Like, she looked like a movie star. And there there were some big time. You know, Woody Harrelson is in there. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, Seymour Hoffman. He's in the s- second one, second or third one. I'm okay. not sure. Yeah, Philip yeah. Seymour Hoffman. Yeah, uh, but they they had some. I was surprised. I was shocked how much I liked it. I I remember watching it, and I was watching it by myself. <laughs> yeah. and, and my wife goes, "That tracks." What are you doing? And I go, "I'm watching the Hunger Games." And she goes, "Okay." And then she went upstairs. And I go, Ooh. "Wait, what's wrong with that? <laughs> watching the Hunger Games." I'm an actor. <laughs> Studying my craft. Yeah, sometimes you get caught watching a show and you're like, be like, what are you, what are you doing? Nothing. Uh, nothing. <laughs> no, nothing. Uh, yeah. yeah, Paul. Remember I saw The Hunger Games and it came in the next day and I said I had issues with it as an archer, not necessarily the movie. <laughs> the acting was fine. The plot yeah. was fine. But was, yeah. The archery wasn't yeah. real enough. Yeah, because Paulie was an archer <laughs> growing up. And then he had a problem with the form, I guess, of Jennifer Lawrence. True to the sport. Yes. <laughs> my people were True upset. True to the craft. My people were upset. Of archery. Someone had to say uh, it. Archery. Uh, 